<laughs> yeah, yeah. So, uh, I'm here at Bernie Falls <laughs> with Tyson Wagner. What's up, Tyson? <laughs> and uh, as you can see, it's quite beautiful. <laughs> um, so, a, a message has been on my heart these last few weeks is about the brilliance of showing up unprepared. And I actually don't mean that unprepared. I mean that you, I mean that I, I've been preparing for this video that I'm shooting right now for 27 years. God has been preparing me. From the moment I come out of my mother's womb to this moment, all my experience have added up to being able to share this look in my eye, the smile on my face, the willingness to take this video even though people are watching me right now. So what I'm suggesting is I truly believe that I think preparing ourselves, you know, writing out a script before a speech is good in some instances uh, or to a certain extent. However, to prepare ourselves to like the point of perfection before we even get started, to me is we're not, we're not, it's not a very faithful act. It's not a very faithful act. I, I believe that if uh, yesterday when I was at Bethel Church and they had called me up on the stage and asked me to give a presentation, I would be fully, fully capable of doing that. Um, I might not know what to say, but the less I prepare to say, the more God has room to speak through me. <laughs> so I just want to let you know that whatever situation that you're encountering, whether it be a job interview, whether it be going on a first date, whether it be um, meeting someone for the first time or making a sale, whatever it is, that you're fully prepared. I am fully prepared. I'm as prepared as I ever will be. And uh, just to live by love and faith rather than fear. So, look, I'm forgetting, I don't have anything to say in this moment. You see it, pause. But what did you learn in that pause? You learned so much, right? There's so much to be learned in, in hearing me pause and not having anything to say. Fully confident, fully confident that the person I am that you're seeing right now is who God wanted you to see, who God created me to be. And I love this idea. Not only does it add more excitement to my life to show up in situations where I haven't prepared or protected myself, Sometimes preparing and protecting are like synonymous. Um, it adds more excitement to my life. And then I get to actually, I say things, and I do things that I never thought I was even capable of saying. And it's beautiful, it's fun. Praise God. Anyway, I'm, uh, I just had to shoot this video right now. It's been on my heart. It's a beautiful spot I want to share with you guys. And um, I have a, uh, my next retreat's coming up in Vermont, September 2nd through the 5th. I would love for you, any East Coasters out there, to be part of it. It's going to be a powerful experience. We're going to be visiting beautiful places, talking about raw honesty, being raw, not just talking about it. You can talk about a menu all day. But until you taste that bite, until you taste that bite of food, you won't fully experience it. So if you think you know what we do on our retreats, think again if you haven't come. To truly understand what happens, you have to experience it firsthand. You have to taste it. You have to feel it. So I'm going to put the link in below if this video is on YouTube. The link will be in the below uh, in the description for you to inquire about coming to Vermont with me. Or if it's on Facebook, it'll be in the link above. Anyway, keep showing up. You're fully prepared. Don't you ever forget that. You're fully prepared. For however long you've been out of the womb, you are fully prepared. Uh, so live by faith and by love. And I want to leave you with my favorite quote. A loser is not someone who comes in second or third place. A loser is someone who's so afraid of failing that they don't even try. God bless you.